always dig around anything in the corners it's always good and a bit of yellow I think there we go there we go strong and it's time to start moving down the background this is done in retrospect probably could have been a bit stronger it's a bit on a weak side but you know I'm not perfect almost but not quite some of these lovely trees and things that are growing closer to us there's kind of this zigzag effect and don't be scared to join it to the top part but some are on their own like this one and there's a line here it all flows through joins up Maybe go up a little bit here and there and we're starting to get this feeling of a distant landscape yeah now the problem I find with students is they can't let go of this. So next four hours they keep going, dead, 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 dead. this dries, the moisture gets attracted, you get cauliflowers and it looks shocking. You must keep moving down. You must just simply keep traveling down that page. If you don't, you will end up with terrible trouble. Is that building, trees around it. There's another building, trees around it. Of a row of trees here, and I let this go down. So another line there, and connection there. It's kind of a this. You've all seen it when you look down. There's paddocks in there and stuff. So there it is. Anything that doesn't look right now will never look right. So you look at it just like we did with the clouds. And you say, okay, this, this funny little thing here is not right. I make a round tree. nothing else there's a distant view to this mountain way back there and just to make sure that this all stays alive just a little piece of life and let it live let it live anything I don't like give it a smaller brush it's an awkward shape here I refine it 